Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and welcome on back to another reaction video. If you have no idea who I am, my name is Sam, aka the OG Bojangles. I'm a streamer over on Twitch four days a week, but on Fridays and Tuesdays, I post first time movie reaction videos, and that's what this is. Today is the second to last Robin Williams movie that I will watch for a bit. Not forever, but for a bit. And I say that because I have a whole bunch planned for you guys for the rest of this year. Ran the poll on Patreon and y'all over there chose this one out of the four that I had listed. Today I'm watching the movie What Dreams May Come. A lot of people have been saying that this is a tearjerker. So we shall see if I cry. <laughs> Other than what you guys said about this being a tearjerker, I don't know anything about this film. So as per usual, going into this movie, not knowing what's going to happen whatsoever. With that said, let's get started, shall we? For those of you who are watching, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for watching and thank you for your support. And to those of you over on Patreon, I really do appreciate y'all over there as well. Thank you so much for your support over there, and I hope you're enjoying all those full unedited reaction videos and the access to the polls. If you wanted access to the polls and or wanted to watch all the full unedited versions of all of the videos that I have here, you can go over to my Patreon. It is $5 a month for the reaction videos and two for the polls. Let's see how this movie goes. As per usual, pretty excited to watch it. I have no idea what to expect. And uh, we'll see if we'll get in our feels with this. Okie dokie. Have a good time watching and I shall see you on the other side. Enjoy. Okay. I don't know what's going to happen in this film, but as per usual, I'm pretty excited. So uh, here we go. It sounds like it's going to be a sad movie. Like just from saying what dreams may come. Like that's that. I, I don't know. When I was young, I met this beautiful girl by a lake. Oh. oh, hey, Scoozy, Scoozy, Scoozy. <laughs> oh, hi. hi. Oh, you're American? Oh, <laughs> nice. <are> you? Oh, <laughs> watch your head. This is young Robin Williamson. Like, pre he's pretty young in this. Can I sit here? Actually, no. Uh, two years ago, I, I reserved this specific <laughs> area. How about if I say please? That's the one exception. <laughs> Uh oh. A man. I'm Chris Nielsen. How did you know I'd be here? I didn't. <laughs> oh, they got married. Why do I feel like something bad is gonna happen? It always does. None of these are happy stories. Oh. You've got to eat something. No, I don't. I can get something at school. Okay, so those are their kids. Well, and I'll see you chorus thing tomorrow. I thought you couldn't. I'll work it out. I don't want to miss it. Oh, mm -hmm. we're late, guys. I'll pull out the van. Hmm. Your mother puts healthy stuff in there, I so know. don't trade it. Tray of chips and cookies. I know. <laughs> well, that's nice. <clears throat> it was the last time Annie and I saw them alive. What? What? Are you? F I when death claims the life. I called it. I literally knew it. I knew it was gonna be a fucking sucker Your punch literally right away. I hate this. So many questions. <laughs> Come on. Are you kidding me? Oh my man, Kim, nothing nice. What happened? What happened? Oh my god, was it like a car crash or something? Wow, nice. Jacobs? Stacy Jacobs? Oh, nice stream. Oh my god. he feels a lot better. He's been wanting to do that for 10 years. Mm -hmm. Stacy Jacobs. <laughs> my kid used to say, hey, what's the difference? You weren't looking anyway. You like rabbits? Yes. And go like this. <laughs> Man, they just dropped a bomb on us and then it's like, all right, four years later, get over it. Hey. <gasps> Pickle oh, bunny! Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Does your head hurt a lot? All the time. Oh. Why don't you do something for me? I want you to cup your hand and cover your nose and your mouth like this. And just breathe in and out. This is Nielsen on four. Oh, it's my wife. The eight pieces from Germany never arrived. 
I've got to choose replacements the night before the opening and get them down here and rehang them and relight them. And I, it's our double D anniversary, and I'm ruining everything. Double D. Yeah. Tell you what. How about this? Uh, how about the Hudson Rivers? Okay. That gives us three. But they're all the way out in Fairfield, and I don't have anybody to send. Well, I'll drop by after work. I'll pick them up and take them over to the gallery. Huh? So their lives seem to have skewed a lot. I love you, Bella. I love you too. Bye. You feel better, didn't don't you? She, didn't she say her name was hmm. Migraines? Annie? I I'm not going. I love you, Bella. Oh. I always remember that. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh my god. Holy crap. I'm a doctor. <laughs> Don't move. Oh my god. How? What? How? Why was that car going? Oh my god. Chris. Hmm? Do you know what's happened? Holy shit. Oh no, is he actually Ginger, you see me. <laughs> she does. Dogs are different. Is that you, Doc? Why are you so huh? blurred? I could clear when you want me to, Chris. Oh my god, he's dead too. You've died, Chris. How come I see everyone, Doc? Everybody. I'm the one you don't want to see. You don't want to be dead. What you want to remember is your kids. And they were still alive. When she goes to the hospital, I'm going to. Oh, what? Oh, what the fuck? They're gonna give her a shot, and it's not gonna hurt, and she's gonna fall asleep. You're going to kill my dog? Oh. I'm going to help her die. Yes. You're going to kill my dog. You get angry. Death does that. What'll happen to her? She'll go where we all go. And how can that be bad? Oh, yeah, this is gonna get me. This is gonna get to me. I feel it already. Fuck. Your mother and I did talk. So, I mean, well, what'd you talk about? About taking you out of Head Royce. Where are we now? This is your funeral. <sighs> At least you're willing to see yourself. You're losing your fear. Fear. As you disappeared, you didn't. You only died. I'm still so curious as to how the children died. Oh, I don't like this. Man! This one's a present for me. It's our double D anniversary. Double D? It's kind of our special day. It's her version of our place. Your place? Where we first met. Where we were going to retire, I guess. That's our dream house. That one's me, I guess. Funeral's over, Doc. Why is this going on past the funeral? Your diary. I'm writing in your bullshit pages because my shrink is crazier than I am. <laughs> I'm here, babe. I still exist. You're thinking of me. I still exist. This is Chris. This is Chris. <laughs> oh, man. Christ, when does it end? It ends when you want it to. What do you think? I'm a figment of your imagination? Who is this? I'm, I'm just confused She's with real. that. You're real. It's all real. Reality is, it's over when you stop wanting to hurt her. Forever. I'm not leaving you alone. I'm not going anywhere. I get what he was saying. And ends when you want to stop hurting her. A.K.A. reminding that he is gone, I guess. Goodbye, babe. <sighs> Yeah. Man, what is what is this? Oh uh, so much pain. Oh, is he back at that uh 
the place where they wanted to retire. Oh. Oh, is he in the painting? Mm hmm. Dougie! Aww. Boy, I screwed up. I'm in dog heaven. <laughs> Oh, I mean, this is kind of like the pain. Yeah, I was about to say. This movie. It's so interesting because this, like, seems like it's the end of a movie, not half, not even halfway in it. It's like not even a fourth in it. So I'm wondering what this movie is gonna really be about, you know? Uh. <laughs> Brett, what the hell you doing? Albert Lewis? Look at you on the water there. Well, hello, somebody. Come on. <laughs> and that was you, just now when, when I died. Can you lend me a hand here? I'm, I'm kind of up to my ass in problems again, Chief. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Come here. You are still kind of ugly. Oh my God. <laughs> nice place you got here. Oh no, 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 no. Nice place you got here. We all paint our own surroundings, Chris. But you're the first guy I know to use real paint. <laughs> Why doesn't it move? It'll move when you want it to. It's so interesting. Can I make a dive? How about maybe turquoise wings? Turquoise! Oh! I didn't do that. No, I did. See? Hey, didn't Annie paint you guys a house somewhere? Yeah, it's over there. Oh my god. Mm. The painting effect is so Let's trippy, you know? Nice shortcut. It's easy, uh. Chris! Look at me! Am I, am I really here? What do you mean by you, anyway? If you lost all your limbs, wouldn't you still be you? I'd still be me. So, what is the me? My brain, I suppose. Your brain. Mm. Your brain is a body part. Why is that the part that's you? Because I... Is sort of a voice in my head. The part of me that thinks, that feels. That is aware that I exist at all. Mm -hmm. So if you're aware you exist, then you do. This is very interesting. I did not expect an immediate multiple deaths. <laughs> Your brain is meat. It rots and disappears. Did you really think that's all that was to you? You see a body because you like seeing one. We're seeing what we choose to see. Right. Let me show you something. Oh. Where's all the paint? You don't need it anymore. This is your world now. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Christy? Right here. Hey, I can't imagine what she's going through, you know? Losing so many people so quickly. Oh, wow. <laughs> Having you with me. <clears throat> from... Makes me happy. Oh. Why do I think you can see this? What's oh. that purple tree? Think you can get there in eight seconds? Yeah, I just need a, a little incentive. Yeah. Mm. I can fly. Oh, oh no, no. Why not? Oh. I can do what I want, right? Well, I think you'd be more comfortable keeping it real. <laughs> oh, God. Adios, muchacho. Oh, wait. oh boy. Oh, my God. I bet you Oh, he's fine. <laughs> he's already dead. Oh my god. Uh, <laughs> yoink. No, she's not there. It's completely new. Mm -hmm. How can I see this drawing after I'm dead? <laughs> For an expert, you look pretty surprised. Yeah, he doesn't know. You and Annie a long courtship? No, actually. In the very first moment, it was like... Soulmate. It's extremely rare, but it exists. Sort of like twin souls tuned into each other. Apparently, even in death. You're reaching each other through a painting. It's, it's nothing I've ever seen, Chris. You can't see it, can you? Me? No. I'm gonna cry, I swear. Oh, no! Don't do that! That sucks. Oh. I love you! It's 
stop it, 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 stop it. Fuck! Ah! No! Oh, this is gonna hurt. That was gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt. <laughs> Look, it's Tigger! It's my daughter's! Oh. She's here, right? Yeah. Where is she? Chris, here is big enough for everybody to have their own private universe. That's not why you haven't seen your kids yet, is it? But what does that mean, Buddha? <laughs> I want to see my children, Albert! When you do, you will. You got a fever. It's going down, though. Don't you have to go somewhere? You want to play chess? No. You could teach me that? Oh, so much. This is so much. Oh, my God. There's <laughs> a lot going on. Hello? Excuse me. Albert has to work. He asked me to meet with you. He has to work? He said you've been isolated. Do you want to see others? Perhaps the city? I would, but travel makes me nauseous. Close your eyes. I didn't mean forever. Up till now, you've been painting your own world. This is mine. Wow. So, there's work. Wow. Mm -hmm. Albert, for example, he's sort of a missionary, saving lost souls. You mean from hell? In a way. My work, on the other hand, is with animals. Mm. <laughs> Katie's an old friend. Oh. If I'd have walked out that night for our double D, you would have never been in that tunnel doing me a favor. The whole family lost in car crashes. Yeah, I figured. Make a person by a bike. <sighs> I figured it was a car crash. Where are they going? They're going to help others be reborn on Earth. Reincarnation. This is nice, but at the same time, it's all people who are dead. Albert says to cheer you up. You have difficulty. Losing my wife. And your children? They died years ago. That's why I'm worried about my wife. They died in a terrible collision. The nanny was driving. It wasn't her fault. Nope, oh, that's not her. It was the trucker's fault. But my wife believed that if she'd been driving the kids, her protective instincts would have... So I'm guessing the nanny okay? died as well. I... Tell me a memory of your own. Same with your daughter. Hey, uh, that's somebody else's art. What's the difference? You weren't looking anyway. Is this where we go when we die? That's a dream, baby. It's a beautiful one. But you know, dreams uh, aren't real. real. It's after midnight. I haven't won yet. It's the first time. <laughs> no, I like that I haven't won yet. It means you're not cheating. And when I win, I really win. She died three months later. We played every night. Yeah. Meant the world to me. <sighs> she never won. I didn't look like this in the body, you know. We flew to Singapore once. My daddy smiled at the flight attendant who looked like this and wore this name tag, Yona. <laughs> he said Asian women are so lovely and graceful and intelligent. He didn't mean only. I know. And what I thought was, when I grow up, I want to be that. Do you still play chess? I think I waited for my partner. <laughs> oh my god. Y'all don't. that California is the strangest place. They sort of push you into it so that you can get it done before your shrink commits you. Mine is suspicious. Another week he might commit me. <laughs> Y'all got me safety. there. Oh, I saw the cut in her. I had the husband and Missed. love I was meant to have. Blessings no one would dare expect from anything as arbitrary as life. And the truth is simply that it's over. I don't get to say goodbye. You're dead and I blew that. I send you my love. Oh, God. That got me. I was holding it, and it got me, and that was nice. There are no words to thank you for finding Marie. she okay? Marie's fine. You'll see her again real soon. She sends her love, especially now. 
We're gonna go through something very hard right now. I'm already like I'm ugly you. crying. I, I I I got a tear on my my shirt. No. Annie's dead. She killed herself. Is that kind of an occupational hazard of soulmates? One's not much without the other. But she's okay because her you pain's over. You don't understand. You no, know, she won't cling like I did. No, you don't understand. When do I see her? Never. It's, she's a suicide. Suicides go somewhere else. What are you punishing her for? No, it's not punishment. She suffered and no, 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 no. Let them be happy for fuck's sake. Everybody. Suicides don't go to hell because they're immoral or selfish. They go for a very different reason. Each of us has an instinct that there is a natural order to our journey. And Annie's violated that. She won't face it. Fuck. She will spend eternity playing that out. I'm her soulmate. I can find her. If there are no rules, how can you say all suicides are the same? I can't. That's a rule. I can't. Okay. And how can you say that Annie can't realize she's dead? Okay. We only know what we and others have seen, and no one has ever seen a suicide brought back. Stick around, Chief. You ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> He's gonna do it. He's gonna do it. I knew it. I knew I was gonna cry in this. I felt it in my bones. So that's that's fun. Probably not the last time in this movie. Oh boy, I, this is gonna be something. Anyone ever tell you too much persistence can get kind of stupid? Constantly. I hear the same thing. Your wife love you strong. We'll find her. Wow. But when you find her, nothing will make her recognize you. You can say everything you long to say, even if she can't understand it, and you'll have the satisfaction that you didn't give up. That has to be enough. You just get me there. I'll decide what's enough. Yeah, he's definitely not gonna give up. Definitely not gonna give up, you know. I... Were you proud of your own kids? Where's his son? Of course. Well, that's an easy bullshit answer. But I put some thought behind it. <laughs> I said, of course. I like this sore point. It's juice. Juice is strong. It connects. It makes you a better receiver for any. She's sort of the transmitter, sending thoughts of you. Oh my god. In hell, there's real danger of losing your mind. Oh my god! Oh, hate that. Hate that a lot. Oh my god! Because he's drowning. That's why. I'm saying he's going through all this. So he won't let me down. No, it's actually worse than that. He's into you so deep, he thinks he's letting himself down. You say he can do something and he can't, and then he thinks he's shit. How sick is that? How can you take <sighs> me out of my school? Don't you think I can make it? You really gotta show me some more, okay, buddy? Come on. You're blowing it, Ian! I'm not you! <sighs> oh, God almighty. Oh, this is terrifying. I hate this. What is this place? It's the gateway to hell. Great. What are we doing? Picking up any signals? Not a ripple. It's because I was thinking of somebody else. Every day I see how I'm not as good as you and everyone else. But that doesn't mean I give up. Man. Hey. Jeez. Oh. If I was going through fucking hell, I only want one person in the whole goddamn world by my side. There's a man Ian never got to know. The man he was growing up to be. I see him as a father. When he looks in his kid's eyes, that kid knows that his dad really sees him. And then that child knows that he's an amazing person. He's quite a guy that I'll never get to meet. I wish I had. Come on, she could be in there. <laughs> Why do they have guns? No! 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 Your mother's not in there, Ian! Your mom's not in there, son. Oh my god. Another man I'd go through hell with. Elevator to hell. 
going out. I'm going with you. I'm not really giving you a choice. Ever since you began to suspect Albert was your son, you've lost all signal from your wife. No, I'm not leaving him. If he never sees her, never says goodbye, we do it without him. We do it together. Come on, she's your mother. Let's go. Dan, no. When you get there, you don't listen to him. You find her, and you bring her back. I wonder why he took the form of Albert, though. I guess because it was someone that he was kind of close with. Did you ever stop to think why I chose to be Albert? Okay, there we go. He was the only guy you ever listened to. Listen to me now. Think about mom. Think about what happened when we died. Think about what you said to her to bring her back. Yeah, wow. This is... It's a lot. You said divorce got my attention. She Did she try to take her own life previously? I we're too different to stay together. Well, for one thing, why aren't you in here? Why didn't you go crazy? Your children died. I thought I was supposed to be strong. For me. For me. For us. And you got a choice. Life either goes on or not. Sometimes when you win, you lose. Oh, yo. Oh my god. This is. This is terrible. This is. This is fucked up. Watch where you step at. Oh. <sighs> oh God Almighty, this is gonna be so bad. Oh, oh, we're gonna be late for the dance thing. What's the rush? This is all just a stall, right? Mean? I know why you don't want to go. It's just that when everybody's dancing, I feel like I'm all alone in the sea of faces. Well. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Ah! What in the flying fuck? Oh my god. You taught me the one thing, the only thing I should always remember. Jesus. I forgot. found her my god is that our house this is this is insane suicides can get pretty tortured pretty committed to punishing themselves you don't want to push her that way you want to see her tell her what's in your heart and then go yeah the whole going bit is wait, just wait. Uh, not gonna happen so you, could get you call your son albert who is that First doctor I interned under. Do you recall what he practiced before he turned to pediatrics? Child's psychiatry. And he was always a slow reader. But these used to be rimless. And the rest of me used to be black. Wow. <laughs> this isn't like the rest of hell, son. You got no defense against Danny. Three minutes. Any more, you could lose your mind. That's so sad. How can you lose your mind? Once her reality becomes yours, there's really no way back. It's really interesting how all of the children took different forms. But it's also sad because they did take different forms, you know? As if their true self wasn't good enough. It's interesting. Who, who are you? I'm your neighbor. I just moved in. You're Annie Nielsen, right? They told me a lot about you. Like what? What did they say? That you're a very talented artist. And work for a museum. And that you're a widow. There are other things missing, too, you know? Some of my favorite paintings. The ones I have to work on. Oh, God. Oh, my God. I got it. You say your paintings are missing. Some of my most precious panels, the ones that remind me. Remind me of my husband and my children. That's why. And of me. My wife committed suicide after our children died. After I 
Don't you have to leave. No. But if you want me to go. I do. All right. The last day I saw my wife, it was our anniversary. I thought you said you were going to leave. In a minute. I was just sticking around in case there's another problem. It was a very special kind of day. No one else knows about. Yeah, I'm curious to know what it stands for or means or anything like that. This is a one-way ticket for me. My hanging around here is not helping you. It's killing me. So today is kind of a D-Day. D for decision, I guess, about divorce. That would be two Ds, wouldn't it? Divorce day? What's true in our minds is true. Whether some people know it or not, that's when I realized I'm part of the problem. Not because I remind you, because I couldn't join you. So I left you alone. But don't give up, okay? But she still killed herself. In the end, she gave up. There's nothing wrong with that. Her husband didn't think so. He was a coward. He pushed away the pain so hard. He disconnected himself from the person he loved the most. I want to see Christy. I can show you. It's not hard. Just close your eyes. Remember where you were married? So close. Fuck. I'm sorry, babe. There's some things I have to say. I've only got a few moments left. Well, it's definitely been over three minutes at this point, right? <laughs> I just wanted us to be old together. Those two old farts laughing at each other as our bodies fell apart. Together at the end. That lake in your painting. That was our heaven, see? There's lots of things to miss. Books. Naps. <sighs> kisses. Thank you for every kindness. Thank you for being someone I was always proud to be with. You were my life. Shit. You didn't think I'd make it out, huh? Nothing you can do could ever help her. Did you come close to losing it? Oh, yeah. So I had to come out now. Tell you, I'm giving up. I don't think he is. <laughs> Just not the way you think. Will you tell my children I love them? Wow. And I won't leave their mother. In one minute, I won't know you any better than you'll know me. But we'll be together. Oh, my God. Where we belong. Good people end up in hell because they can't forgive themselves. <laughs> no, I can't. But I can forgive you. For killing my children and my sweet husband. Being so wonderful, a guy would choose hell over heaven just to hang around you. Not because I remind you. Not because I couldn't join you. Christy. Thank you. Christy. Oh, God, no, 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 oh, no, 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 no. Don't give up, don't give up, don't give up, Christy. knows if it worked or not oh god wonder how he ended up uh, <laughs> hey. there we go you did it you did it Chris you did it yay sometimes when you lose you win <laughs> yeah I mean they're dead but at least they're together Oh, it's an emotional roller coaster. I tried everything, nothing worked. Until you tried joining me. Well, at least that worked. 
Excuse me, lady. Mm -hmm. Ready for that surprise, I promise. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's not the surprise. Mommy? Mm. This is so nice, but it's so sad because they're all dead. <laughs> But they're all together and that's what matters. I want us to grow old together. Can we do that here? Mm hmm I want it all. As long as it's with you. It will be. But what about going back? Being reborn? Finding each other? All over again? Falling in love? That would be interesting. Don't worry about the kids. I'll be here. A whole human life is just a heartbeat here in heaven. Then we'll all be together forever. Well, how will I find you? Found you in hell. What, do you think I could find you in Jersey? <laughs> oh. Uh. <laughs> when I was young, this beautiful girl by a lake. That's so nice. Fuck me, man. Oh my god. <sighs> Just get back there. Oh my god. Oh, shit. I got tears on my shirt again. <sighs> this movie messed me up a bit. I, I guess I didn't really expect it to, but it was dealing with... <sighs> a lot of topics that I think about and, like, kind of panic about a little bit. So I guess that's kind of why... Uh, why, I guess, I'm sensitive to it, you know? <sighs> Despite... The tears. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> oh my god, I'm a freaking mess right now. Jesus. <sighs> right from the beginning, it was just a roller coaster of emotion. And right away, it pretty much just threw you for a loop. Because I didn't expect any of that. <laughs> I didn't know what the movie was about. I didn't even realize that anybody was gonna die. But of course, of course, people died. Of course. And the whole family fucking died. Yeah, that's great. Great. And like, yeah, of course that's upsetting if it is and but it's the fact that they all found each other in a place we can kind of only hope to be. <sighs> my shirt! Oh my god. <laughs> a place where we can only hope to end up. But yeah, there's a uh... This movie really kicked my ass emotionally. <laughs> I told you, I told you already that once I start crying, I just like, it's so hard for me to stop because I keep thinking about it, thinking about more things that go with it. And it's like, I spiral, <laughs> but I'm trying to come back. I definitely, you know, held, held it. You know, I held it. There were points before that first initial cry where I just kind of held it in you know I was just like oh this is this is rough we're getting getting a little rough getting a little rough but then just his daughter talking to him and them just reuniting in that way it was just like oh yeah that really uh kicked my ass definitely and then there were just points throughout that just uh really hit hard not showing it in the edit but I did I I <laughs> I went back like three times to the end where Annie says, I want it all as long as I'm with you. That part and just like literally why I'm crying, you know, <laughs> it's because I just think about my own partner who I've been with for two and a half years now. And I just always think about, you know, her with things like this. Again, it, that's exactly how I was thinking when I was watching Philadelphia, especially. There were just so many points where... I saw Chris's and Annie's relationship as my own and like the, f the strong feelings that were there and everything and the whole like soulmates thing and the comparison and just the, the 
you know, it was, just, it was just a lot. So I was just thinking about all of that. And then there's just, you know, the whole death thing itself, which I'm just fucking terrified of, right? It's a fear that I have. It's an inevitable fear that I have, but I, I have it. And so when movies just hit, hit, hit with that topic, you know, like it, it kicks my ass. And this was all about that. So it really just effed me up clearly <laughs> so it was just that and then what i was just talking about before literally being just like the topics of like a single movie it's like wow there you go how to make sam cry 101 this fucking movie like this literally this was it it was really well done though it was it was so sad but it was also so relatable in so many different ways like i just explained but just in, in so many different ways. But movies like this are the best, the ones that you can relate to in so many different ways and you can see yourself in, you know, the relationship part, the inevitability of death and maybe even the fear of it is there. The hope that there is something beyond that that is a forever. Those all hit me and that is why I'm a mess, so... <laughs> And I didn't expect that. And I didn't expect to cry so hard. <laughs> but this was, it was really nice overall. The points where they were just all meeting up with each other again. Especially the daughter. I mean, that sent me over the edge, right? The first time. We have that. And then you have his son being the person who was there since he got to, I guess you would call it heaven in this case. And then you have the tracker actually being the doctor that he had first interned under and it was all these reveals <laughs> and it was just really nice to see you know and I was trying to say this before um but it was all just messy before but it was really interesting to see them take forms of people that were not themselves his daughter took the form of someone who his father found I guess you know attractive in a lot of different ways and not necessarily like romantic attraction but just attraction uh and his daughter I guess kind of saw that and applied it to how she wanted to look because she wanted to meet his standards I guess you know what I mean same thing for his son he wanted to be someone who like he said would how Chris would listen to but also someone that he admired and then I guess with the the doctor himself, I'm still not entirely sure why he took that form, but maybe it was just because he looked wise. <laughs> he looked like someone that you would go to for guidance, maybe. I'm not sure about that one. But all these people took on different roles to try to maybe attract Chris. And again, not in a romantic way, but to have him go to, to first I guess if does that make any sense but I, in some ways I guess I was thinking this before it's kind of sad because they're not being their true selves because maybe they don't think that he would notice them if they were them true selves but he would because they were just children so that's still a back and forth but it was still interesting nonetheless overall this was really good this was a really good emotional kick in the ass you know it was emotional it was crazy because they all died and the story was just unique and I personally can relate to it again in a lot a lot of different ways so this one was this one was good and it's definitely a movie that I'm gonna remember and it having a, a, an impact on me so those of you who wanted me to watch this I hope that you enjoyed me and my blubbery crying self <laughs> I really hope you enjoyed this reaction, everybody who is watching. If you did enjoy the reaction, please feel free to like the video. And if you aren't already, please feel free to subscribe. If you wanted to watch the full emotional mess that I went through and not just the edited version, and if you wanted to watch the full unedited reactions to any of the other films that I've watched, you can absolutely do so over on my Patreon. It is $5 a month for that. And of course, those of you who are already on Patreon, I really do appreciate you guys. Thank you for the support over there. Thanks for just hanging out. I hope you've been enjoying all that extra content. If you wanted to find me outside of YouTube, you can absolutely do so. You can pretty much find me anywhere at the OG Bojangles. Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, all that good stuff. But I'm mainly on Twitch four days a week, Monday through Thursday at 6 p.m. EST. I'm still trying to just get myself together. It's this was this was a lot. 
and I haven't cried this much in a minute, I think. Definitely haven't cried this much in a movie in a minute, I would say. But it's good. It really is good to have a movie that brings out this emotion, this deep emotion within you. And yeah, it, it did. It did. I really do hope that you guys all enjoyed this reaction. And I guess I'll see you in the next one. Okie dokie. Toodaloo. Adios. And goodbye. Oh, oh, oh.